What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. What's going on, people? Uh, you know who it is. I, you saw the intro, so I'm just going to roll right into it. Today we're going to be discussing about uh, what Henry Rollins said about Robin Williams. To give you a background information, if you don't know who Robin Williams is, Robin Williams was an actor, American actor who committed suicide. He was 63. Now that being said, Henry Rollins, if you don't know who Henry Rollins is, he's, he's, a, he's a singer. I forget, I forget his band's name, but Henry Rollins, but Henry Rollins is a, had, had his own group, I think, too. I'm not sure, but I know who Henry Rollins is. He's a he's a hard metal singer. If you want to ask me about hard rock, if you want to call that alternative music, I, I don't know if he's really alternative, but look up Henry Rollins. It's on fucking YouTube. Back to the top of your hand. Henry Rollins called Robin Williams selfish for taking his life, and all of a sudden, all the all the all the tree huggers, all the save the whales, all the all the were, were roping the dolphins, all these type people came and to bash Henry Rollins for what he said. He said Henry Rollins didn't, to me, Henry Rollins didn't say anything that was negative or bad. He said for your children that you were being selfish, you took your life. What's wrong with that? What can you say that is wrong with that stance? on suicide. Now I know I'm gonna get you tree huggers and you apologists and all you crybabies saying, well he wasn't in his right mind and you don't know how bad the deep thought of depression is. Look man, what Henry Rollins said was right. Ron Rollins killed himself. I mean, look man, if you put he put himself I mean I know he I know he had substance abuse, he had mental issues, but at the same time, he had the money to control all this. So, you, you, the problem is in America, we want to be coddled, we want your ears tickled, your bellies rubbed. You want to tell everything's going to be all right, even when it's not all right. But this is, there's no accountability in America, is what I, what I talk about. There's no accountability, there's no, no, no responsibility, there's no after effects of what you do. Because what you do is, and it, it trickles down from the head state, the head of our country. But this is, they made it so bad in this country, that you can do whatever you want to do without any repercussions, but only certain people get repercussions. Like, everybody got an excuse for everything. Like I said, at the end of the proverbial day, in my stance on this topic, I think Henry Rollins was right. Robin Rollins was selfish. Now, if you don't like that, that's your opinion, and like you can say what you want to say, but you know, I'm tired of hearing all these excuse-making, tree-hugging apologists for Robin Williams. Now, Lauren McCall died that same week. I would, have more, I would have been more than happy to celebrate her life over Ronald Williams because Ronald Williams was, he was just, what, he couldn't take because his wife was screwing him over and, and alimony? Whose whole lady had not screwed him over once you separate? FYI. But the fact of the matter remains. Henry Rollins made the statement that he was selfish because of his kids. He wasn't thinking, he was thinking only of himself. And what can you say? Was he wrong? No, he wasn't wrong. He was being selfish. But, you know, that's the problem. You guys want to be friends with your kids? That's what happens when you're friends with your kids. You don't tell them the real truth. And Ron spoke the real. He spoke the truth. I can't hate that. So, I'm out. Peace.